What's up everyone? Welcome back to another video. We're actually playing once again on the prison realm, of course, over on Fade Cloud. But before this video begins, okay, just see that little thing on the screen right now? It's called zap.fadecloud.com. Please put that into your multiplayer server list and then join the server. If you can connect with my IP, it will help support me a ton. So, you know, it's greatly appreciated. Okay, so there's a few things that have happened since last episode. Firstly, I got my orb greed all the way maxed out to a thousand because I was playing a little bit later last night but i wasn't able to record at that time and then i also have 30 million orbs now i have a lot of these orbs because i have been slash afk mining literally all night long and i'm making about 200k orbs per minute so we have a lot of things we can do today now and i also have 12 fragments and we can spend 10 of those in the slash m cube or the fragmenter and you know we just get something it's uh yeah 10 percent rank orbs that's only 24k orbs but it's still not bad now i've learned a few things the number one thing to do is firstly max out orb greed and then you want to get to dragon burst to about level 500 and then you also want to get your fortune enchant to also level 500 and the like if you get these enchantments to this you will start making a crap load of money fortune increases the amount of blocks you get when you mine but at the same time you're also going to be selling that for more orbs and a dragon burst has a chance to destroy an entire layer of the mine when it gets to level 500 you have a 0.5 percent chance for it to activate so that's pretty high but these enchantments are crazy expensive so i think before we go into that i want to see how high of a rank we can get to so let's type slash max rank oh wait it's uh it's slash rank up and max and that put us all the way to level 231 and we have a whole new mine okay this is very very interesting so i'm going to cut to a quick clip that i started recording before this well before we started recording the video and that was me doing the potato event if you don't know what the potato event is i guess it'll be shown in the next clip but you basically mine to collect potatoes and then you can use them in a potato shop all right the hot potato event started i currently have six and i want to try getting first place in this we've gained the two already another one another one all right we have six total i think for first place we need to get at least like 12. i'm getting so unlucky i haven't gotten one in like 30 seconds well i actually just got one we have eight total and no are you kidding me the fifth place person got nine potatoes and i had eight well we can now access the potato shop and with 10 potatoes we can buy a common cube box but i think what we'll do is just save these and eventually get a legendary one so every single hour the potato event happens as i was saying and hopefully we can try doing these every single hour and eventually get that legendary cube box but i guess there's not much else to do than start the grind and start mining oh wait a minute my robots slash robots what i discovered about robots is your robots will work every so they work 12 hours when you get offline so let's say every 12 hours you log back on collect them then you have another 12 hours of offline work so robots are super super good and from both of these we have 2.7 million orbs so that's pretty good let's just upgrade our dragon burst enchant to the max and that gave me 22 levels and let me just double check do we have any oh we do we have two lucky keys now i don't really think lucky keys are worth getting i don't really want to get this key finder enchantment in my opinion i just don't find them very good maybe they are good when you're like a super high rank because the higher rank you are the more orbs you get from when you win them but this will be the ultimate test here i want to see how many orbs we can get in this minute dude 3.8 million orbs in the last 60 seconds that's absolutely crazy oh yeah i forgot about the giveaway winner so uh congratulations to whoever is on the screen right now you will receive the 2500 clouds that i did in the last video so we're actually doing of course another giveaway but we're only doing a thousand clouds which is equivalent to ten dollars if you want to enter this giveaway uh well, make sure you use my IP, zap.fadecloud.com. That would be greatly appreciated. But other than that, just subscribe to the channel, leave a like on the video, and comment below your in-game name. And if you are on Bedrock, then make sure you specify that you are a Bedrock player. But oh my god, dude, we almost got 4 million orbs in that 60 seconds. Okay, so maybe my goal for this video is to try getting these enchantments to both level 500 so let's max this out and that gained us 18 levels by the way this is what the pickaxe is looking like right now gem greed 42 orb greed a thousand key finder 32 haste 5 speed 5 fortune 120 and then dragon burst 137 oh wait i also learned that these skins are actually really really good so like this one you can summon the bomb squad to fire off explosions in the mine this one is the tsunami wave this one's a storm this one's a big star that blows up the mine 
one, and then this one is an evil clone, which will be three times stronger than you. Okay, so this is something interesting I just found out. I probably shouldn't sell my uh, my robots, but I'm gonna sell one of them here because if we sell this, I'm gonna be getting 75k gems, which I will be able to upgrade my other robot a ton, which that'll it'll basically be smarter to do this. I'll basically 5x the output of my one iron robot. Wait, wait, this guy just offered 100k? Wait, they're bidding. They're bidding. 120k, 130k. Okay, they're arguing right now. I'm curious if he'll buy, want to get more. Keep it for 130. Oh my god, no way. I just basically got double the amount of money. Awk hand, 130k for gems. All right, there we go. We put up the iron robot for 130k gems. Let's see if we get it. Boom. Now we have, oh my god, 144,000 gems. Okay, so I have something very, very cool to show everybody. And I originally wasn't going to sell my iron robot, but I'm going to now. So let me sell the other one. Let me quickly grab it. Putting it up now. Slash awk hand 130k orbs. Wait, no, 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 gems. Okay, so when that's selling, I have three of these crazy cool loot boxes. I was finally able to do my kit, so this will super boost our progression. Let's open the first one, and hopefully we can get, like, a crap load of orbs. I mean, I don't really know what we'll get from these. I got one lucky robot, three dark pet eggs, and then two legendary orb pouches. This robot holds the ability to automatically generate lucky keys. What the heck? Slash robot. So this will automatically generate keys for us. That is crazy. The current rate is one lucky key every minute and I can upgrade. Oh my God. And then we have these pets that we can open. I don't have any pets yet. This will be super good, but let's open up the next one. I do know that there's these armor sets. So maybe it might be good to get one. Oh yeah, we just got one. So the galaxy leggings, it gives you an ability. It just gives you an extra lucky key when mining. That's not bad. We got a 2X ores booster. Pretty good. A gem robot. Very interesting. So this gives me 15 gems per minute. That is, oh my, dude, I'm getting very lucky. This is very good. But finally, the last one to open. Please give me some good stuff. All right, five legendary cubes, five master keys. Ooh. Okay, let's open up the pets first. Let's see if we get anything good. I got a robot pet. Collect more orbs from robots. Okay, that seems pretty good. Next one is locksmith pet. Increase the amount of lucky keys you gain by 1%. All right, and lastly, it is another locksmith pet. Very interesting. I think that this robot one will be very, very good if we get more orb robots, but I actually, like, I haven't gotten any other ones. These are really interesting, though. Like, I can't wait to see how many keys we get, like, per minute or and gems per minute when we upgrade them. Oh my god, we have a million gems. That is absolutely crazy. Okay, we have five legendary cube boxes. This is huge. Please give me... Okay. So these two are kind of worthless for us right now. And then we have the dragon burst one, which is a 41% success chance. This one would be really good if it worked. But I don't have the meteor or hurricane enchantment, so they're kind of useless for now. Let's just remove this two meteor boost one. We'll just confirm that. If this can work, it's only a 41% chance, so I'm not going to be upset if it doesn't work but this will be game changing and it didn't work are you kidding me are you serious but we did get these two locksmith pets so if we upgrade them together we can make an epic plus so for now we will obviously use that pet we also get this so we do get extra lucky keys and then yeah i think that's pretty much all so let's go to the robots now and okay this i don't know which one to upgrade let's upgrade this one this makes it 20 gems does this just add more lucky keys oh wait it's not upgrading i don't think you can upgrade this robot i mean that's still pretty good though but let's go back over to the gem robot and upgrade upgrade i don't want to use all of it in case we get a better robot but you know this will come in very handy oh wait it's already max level okay so we just have 800 000 gems left over now i'm curious if we can buy any armor sets on the ah wow okay these galaxy armor pieces go for like 3 million gems orbs cube it's a 58 percent chance for it to work oh that's 5 million i just can't afford that this guy is selling a ton of lucky robots i just oh Oh, there's nothing good on here. All right, let's filter by cubes because I really do want a cube. Fortune cube has a 1% boost. Okay, that's pretty bad. Gems boost.
boost. It's just not worth it. We want to buy a really high percent chance one because we could just spend our money and then we would get nothing out of it. Yeah, but it looks like we won't be able to really buy any cubes. Even the gold robots are crazy expensive. I was going to save the rest of these two for my next video, but I just really want to open them. So let's do it. I'm hoping we can get ourselves some sort of uh, uh, like a new a new robot five master keys and then just pouches all right last one come on okay either armor or robots that's what i want okay oh an obsidian robot and then a galaxy chest plate this is actually so good okay slash robots obsidian robot 125k orbs per minute okay this is going to be quite expensive but look how, oh my god i just spent all of my gems but this gives me 1 million orbs every single minute that means in the 60 minutes i get 60 million orbs and when i go offline i will literally get 720 million orbs just from doing nothing all right this is going really well i'm also just gonna upgrade this key finder enchantment now considering that it's not that expensive and we do have these armor pieces and that pet activated wait i did get cranky though i have 10 master keys open all those dude we got a diamond robot all right i guess let's equip that one too slash robots okay let's try just upgrading this as much as we can so this one will give me only 125k orbs every minute but that's still really good and we got some of these oh a pet booster okay so i guess what we should do right now is i'm definitely going to save these boosters but i guess let's see how much money we can make in the minute now i think it'll be about 4 million orbs but I'm curious on how many lucky keys we will get. Oh, wait, I actually have nine lucky keys. And <laughs> I just want to double check. We go to slash robots. We already have five more keys. That is crazy. So slash crates and we'll just open all those. And that gave me, oh, that's not bad. I mean, it gave me like 80K ores, but if we can just like AFK and for an example, we will have like, I think it's 720 lucky crate keys from 12 hours of AFK. I really wish I was able to get that dragon burst cube though, because we would be shredding through this mine oh wait oh wait i just got 10 million orbs from my mine level up but we have 10 more fragments so let's slash m cubes and what are we getting 250 gems oh by the way the pet's already level six all right let's actually slash rank up max this is going to take a lot longer to get to our first prestige we need to be rank level 1000 maybe by next episode we'll be able to do that because with all of our robots being like super crazy now we should definitely have over a billion orbs by next episode I feel like mining to get orbs is so useless. It would be a lot better if I had like better enchantments, of course, but like take a look at this. We already have 4 million orbs from the obsidian. While I was mining, I got a notification about the battle pass challenge so we can claim this unique cube box and also the elite crate key. Okay, I guess like I don't have the battle pass so I can't claim this, but I got a unique cube box. Okay, please give me something good. <gasps> Wait, we got an orbs cube for 46% chance? I don't know if I want to do this, though. I mean, I might as well try it, right? Yup, of course it failed. All right, well, what I'm going to plan on doing for the next few hours is slash AFK mining. Uh, now, I think this is actually going to wrap up today's video. I don't know if it, maybe the episode was a little bit short. I don't know exactly because I haven't edited it yet. Anyways, thank you all for watching. Make sure you switch over to my IP zap.fadecloud.com. For some reason, I'm lagging right now, but yeah, make sure you use my IP. It would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe to the channel and all that good stuff, but... I will catch you all later.